Kitui County was the next stop for ODM Deputy Party Leader Musalia Mudavadi and his brigade as he seeks to woo ODM delegates to give him the nod to be the party's flag bearer in the upcoming general election. He arrived at the town hall to a rapturous welcome from ODM delegates from the Kitui County. While the G7 was at it in Nyahururu, it was getting its own share of vitriol in Kitui from none other than Water Minister Charity Ngilu. Gari imeenda, ilikuwa G7, naona sasa ni G6, na huko mwingine anafurutwa na hiyo gari ametupa through the window, sasa hiyo sielewi na nani. Wakiteleza hiyo si hoja yetu, sisi tunalengo, na tufate lengo letu. Na lengo letu tunataka ODM imarike, Kenya imarike, tuwe na sheria nzuri, tuende mbele. Mudavadi said that his decision to challenge Prime Minister Raila Odinga for the ODM ticket had not given rise to any bad blood between the two, but rather it was a sign of internal democracy within the country's most popular party. Mara kwa mara, watu wanasema utavunja chama. Mimi nasema sivunji chama. Na sasa hatuna uhasama kati yangu na muenzangu Raila. Kama orange ni chama ambacho kinasimamia demokrasia, na tunataka kuongoza serikali hii ni muhimu tuonyeshe nchi mzima ya kwamba ndani ya orange hiyo kuna democracy kabla tutoke hata nje chama cha ODM ndio chama ambao itaweza sasa kupeleka Kenya mbele mwaka wa 2013 Mudavadi maintained that he wants ODM's nominations to choose its presidential candidate to be conducted at the county level. Meanwhile, in Machakos County, Vice President Kalonzo Musyoka declined to respond to any of the bashing he was receiving from the Nyahururu rally and the ODM delegates meeting in Kitui. The Vice President was attending the funeral of former Traffic Commandant and Public Service Commissioner Mary Mwangangi in Moor Hills, chose instead to only eulogize the deceased. I wonder how many of us would have that spirit to fight on even when the odds are clearly pitted against you. So we come to say to Mary, we appreciated you. Internal Security Minister Professor George Saitoti, who is also aspiring for the presidency of the PNU ticket, was in Iten in Osangishu County. He says he is the best place to inherit the seat from President Mwai Kibaki and will continue with a record set in infrastructure development, economic growth and youth employment. Tujenge taifa ya amani. Tujenge taifa ambayo itaendelea mbele. Tujenge taifa ambayo itaweza kupanua uchumi wetu na vijana wetu na wasana wetu waweze kupata kazi. Hii ndio ile kitu ambayo tunashida wakati huu. And in Machakos, Gashoka MP Mutava Musimi, who has also declared interest in the presidency, says he will vie for the seat on a DP ticket. Musimi, who is also the chairman of the Parliamentary Committee on Land and Natural Resources, says he made the decision after wide consultations with the secretariat and his family. Andrew Ochiang, Citizen Weekend.